Da er vi her sammen med Smulik, som er da leder for LSRL Tur, som vi bruker da som eh, eh, busser og eh, service. Yes, Smulik, how is the feast for you? I think the joy of seeing a fulfillment of prophecy, seeing people from the nations coming to Jerusalem, wherever you go, you see people that love Israel dancing and singing and worshiping. I don't know if you know, there are like seven Feast of Tabernacle in town today. Yeah, I don't know if you are clear over it, but there are seven different Tabernacle or Lovite Fester right now. So how many tourists uh, are under your wings this, uh, these days. How many tourists are under your wings here? Many, 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 many thank you, oh. by, by the grace of God. <laughs> How many buses do you have? How many buses do you have? In Jerusalem at the moment? Yeah. Maybe 50. Uh, han har 50 buses around Jerusalem. Yes, yeah, so the tourist industry is one of the biggest uh, thing in Israel, right? Also, tourist industry is one of the største industry in Israel. I think, being honest, high tech is the biggest industry. Yeah, for to be honest, so high technology is the biggest business now. But tourism is low tech, and tourism is blessing people immediately. You see, high tech, some people are getting very, very rich. Yeah. I don't know if you know, for example, the Waze program. Uh -huh. So it's five, six families who became very, very rich. Yeah. But tourism gives work to so many people, yeah. from the Belmont men, to the cleaning, to the waiters, to the guides, drivers. So it's blessing everybody in the nations. Yeah. Well, is this the biggest uh, time uh, for you when it comes to to tourists? Yeah, there's no doubt that the Jewish, the high holidays are a very important factor in tourism. And between both Jews and Gentiles are coming to Jerusalem yeah. and all the hotels are packed. Well, thank you so much for the good service you've given to us great, and great all honor. the other group. It's a great honor to serve TV Vision and the work you're doing and the stand that you guys are taking, the biblical stand that you guys are taking with Israel. It's not always popular to stand with Israel. It's not all obvious. It's not always the smartest thing to do with Israel, but thank you for what you're doing. Thank you.